Published 0726 EDT, 19 September 2017 Updated 0726 EDT, 19 September 2017 Bitcoin's value has been extremely volatile, but recent months Moscow has requested the extradition of a Russian national also wanted in the United States for laundering billions of dollars through a Bitcoin exchange he operated, a judicial source said Tuesday. Alexander Vinnick who headed Psi, an exchange he operated for the Bitcoin cryptocurrency, was indicted by a U.S. court in late July on 21 charges ranging from identity theft and facilitating drug trafficking to money laundering. He has been languishing in a Greek jail since his arrest on July 25 in the tourist resort of Halkidiki, near the northern city of Thessaloniki. According to the judicial source, Vinnick said he would not contest Moscow's request, dated August 10. He is wanted there on separate fraud charges totaling €9,500 $11,000. According to U.S. authorities, Vinnick, 37, stole identities, facilitated drug trafficking, and helped to launder criminal proceeds from syndicates around the world. In addition, Tsi was noted for its role in numerous ransomware and other cybercriminal activity, receiving more than $4 billion worth of Bitcoin over the course of its operation. Tsi, founded in 2011, became one of the world's largest and most widely used digital currency exchanges, but according to the indictment, it was heavily reliant on criminals engaged in identity theft and drugs, as well as corrupt public officials. Vinnick was also charged with receiving funds from the infamous hack of Mt. Gox an earlier digital currency exchange that eventually failed, in part due to losses attributable to hacking. The Treasury Department has fined C$110 million for willfully violating U.S. anti-money laundering laws, and Vinnick $12 million. In July, Treasury Secretary Stephen Nutch inhaled Vinnick's arrest and indictment, saying that cracking down on illegal uses of the cyber currency is a key goal of U.S. regulators. The Greek justice system will now have to decide whether Vinnick heads to Moscow or Washington. Sorry we are not currently accepting comments on this article.